Hey, it's Savvy Nick, and today we'll be going through how to install a local web server on a Linux machine. You'll also be able to release this publicly once you get it set up. We'll do this by installing something called Apache Web Server on a Linux Ubuntu 18.04 platform PC. This process should be similar in most distributions of Linux. To begin, we'll open up a new instance of Terminal to make this quick and easy. Control Alt T, shortcut to open it up. Let's go ahead and make sure we have the latest and greatest repos by doing sudo apt update. It's going to ask you for a password, put your password in, and let this run its course. Afterwards, to install Apache, it's simple. All we're going to go ahead and type in is sudo apt install Apache 2. Go ahead and press in. It's going to go ahead and ask you if we have enough free space to go ahead and install this on. I'm just going to say yes. Give it permission. It's going to download and install Apache Web Server. And once this is finished, you'll actually have a working web server on your Linux box. Alright, it's done. So let's go ahead and check if the web server is running by going ahead and opening up the browser. We'll just use the default browser, Firefox here. All right, let's go ahead and just type in localhost here. Press center. Should get a loaded page and it says Apache Ubuntu default page. Awesome. So this is a good sign if you got this page, this means that your web server was successfully installed. Now we'll go ahead and change this generic page to post something different to our screen. You'll be able to locate the default page for Apache under the following location. Go back to terminal, let's do a sudo, we'll open it up using Vim. You can go ahead and open it up using a text editor or whatever you want, it's just an HTML page. Uh, under var www.html uh, and there's some files in it. So index HTML. Go ahead and open that up. Ask me for my password. Oh, I don't have them, so let me install that real quick. Um, um, Alright, let me try again here. Vim, var, www.html, index.html. And here you go. You see this is the page that you currently see in the Firefox window. What I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to delete everything in here. I don't need any of this. Oh, that's a read only file. Let's go back to that real quick. We got sudo. Okay, sudo vim. Now let's go ahead and delete everything in here. Once everything's deleted, we're going to go ahead and add in a couple of tags here. Let's do the HTML tag. Close off the HTML tag. We'll also add in a head for good measure. Close the head tag. And a body tag. Go ahead and inside the body tag, I'm just going to put something generic here just so we can see a change. Um, let's see, I'm going to center this. And I'm going to put Savvy Nick right here. Go ahead and bold this as well, just to make it a little fancier. All right. So I'm going to write this and we should see a change now. I'm going to go ahead and refresh my page, and there you go. Savvy Nick was here. If you'd like to open this up to the public, you can work on your router's firewall settings and allow port 80 to be forwarded to the computer that you installed Apache on. I wouldn't suggest doing this, but you can research how if you like. I suggest that you just keep this a local web server for testing purposes. 
on a local network or potentially hosting web apps in an office or on a local network. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and comment below. I hope this was quick and easy to follow, and let me know if there are any other subjects you'd like to cover or explore on Linux. I look forward to seeing you on my next video. Thanks for watching.